this lab that you're going to go into has almost all female students, and it is led by a female instructor. So it's an interesting uh, dynamic with the, the female population increasing with the mortuary science practitioners. They're really swollen. The tendons are swollen. The, the muscle bellies themselves are swollen. Just go like that with your finger and, and open up that. See that? Release it a bit so you're not at risk of... We've accepted donations of over 29,000 individuals. In 2008 here, we are a 100% informed consent program. We don't accept donations of transient individuals or individuals whose bodies are unclaimed at the medical examiner's office. The mortuary science students are the first uh, group of health science practitioners to receive the, the, the donor's remains, and they help us by anatomically preparing the, the donor for study, and then the medical students will um, also have access to the, the donor at that point. And what you see over here on this side, on the right side, is the rate of flow. So how many ounces of fluid are actually going through the, the donor system per minute? Mortuary science because I'm interested in helping um, families cope with their loss. Not only that, but I'm very interested in like the human anatomy aspect of it. With this, we can actually help the families cope by making their family members look really good at the, you know, at their service.